One man on a lone journey to the Olympics with just five other men. His mission to cover the games in a way that has never been seen before. There will be action, adventure, and unexpected mayhem. With state-of-the-art broadcasting facilities, you'll learn more about the games than ever before. It only comes around every three years, and I, frankly, from what I've heard from other people, you know, it was unacceptable. Four, it's four years. Well, three off, it doesn't really matter, John. I think oh, the point no, that, I thought that Jason's we're going to be accurate. Care. Care. He'll talk to the sports stars oh, yeah. and well, sports fans. It's a stupid one. It's not no problem, stupid, stupid about it. Why is it stupid? There will be legendary interviews. Hey, mate. She well, I'm excited. I'm here with someone who needs no introduction. And he's on your level. And the idea is that they're going to observe all facets of the team program, not just the coaching. He'll ask the big sporting questions that the others are just too scared to ask. I was just wondering, this is in, in a test match on there for full 80 minutes. What happens if someone needs to do poos and some of that? <laughs> <laughs> she actually wanted to know. Hey, look at I'm media. See yeah. that? Yeah, I don't no, care. look at it. I really don't care. Look at it. Well, that says I'm part of the media, which means I may have a bit of insight of what's going well, on that you clearly it. don't. There's more. He's an ex-athlete. In that track suit, you can do anything, I reckon. He'll not only cover the games, as always, he'll become part of the story. You're clearly oh, not a multi-sport athlete. You can't handle multi-sport. You can't handle multi-sport, can you? He'll pull back the veil, taking you behind the scenes. We worked, worked really hard at the back. Uh, we covered a lot of ground. Um, when, he, when he tackled, he tackled hard. When he ran, he ran hard. And uh, so we're just trying to get him some confidence at, at this level to, to um, you know, keep progressing. He's a very good player. Oh. Well, I don't want your opinion. Well, then why did you ask me at the beginning? People are like, you make me sick. You're an idiot. You come oh, down here. Really hey, yeah, walk away. Go on, loser. And he's the consummate touring professional. Did you or did you not make full use of the minibar services in this hotel? No, OK, OK. We love your country. It's a magic place to come for a Rugby World Cup. You've put on a great show. Thanks a lot, Lee. See press conference action. Well, I think we certainly respect them. The best in the world. And for us, it's New Zealand. You know, they're the ones that we've always competed most strongly against. He's covered the Olympics before. Because even though the Olympics are over, he's finally made it to Athens. No, no, no. I'm, I'm, in, I'm in London at the moment, Rick. You, you can see that, surely. Why well, are you in Athens? Which is Athens, please. <laughs> is that any good to you? So, if you want hard hitting Olympic coverage, you'll be watching Olympico. Lee Hyatt, Sports Journal, brings you Olympico. August 2012, Comedy Central.